Hey guys, sorry about the noise. I'm in my mom's um work. She works in hair salons, so it's a little bit of talking. But anyway, so I'm going to be doing this look, and it's just like a natural, natural eye with a dark lid and a sort of like crease. And yeah, basically what I'm using is one eyeshadow palette, and it's called Coffee Bean by Revlon. I'm using this eyebrow comber. And it's from Kmart. This is a brush that I happen to, that my mom's happy, that my mom happens to have. This is a artisty brush. It's just you know the big powder brush. And I'm using the Natio um, Natio Mineral Pressed Powder Bronzer. And it's in Sunswept. I'm using the uh, Volume million lashes. I love this thing. And then I'm just using a black eyeliner that my mom had to have. <laughs> so without further ado, I did this side before I came on. Um, but without further ado, let's get into the look. Okay, so I'm not using any brushes except for this one. But first I'm going to take this um, bronzy um, it's actually like a metallic -y brown with a bit of um, silver in it. But you just want to apply this all over the, your eyelid. So yeah, let's do that. And then you just keep on building it up like that. And now for the... Sorry, I'm dropping things. Now for the crease, and I'm going to apply this light silvery brown shade. Um, it's kind of hard to apply it because I'm not left handed, and this is my left eye. But that's okay. So you just want to work it in there, sister, or brother, or other. Um, but yeah, you just want to work this in your crease. And then you want to grab your pinky and blend it out like this. And again, you want to build up the color. Okay, and once you're finished applying, um, you're blending it out. Blending it up, um, I just applied a little bit more of the um, lid color. Now I, I'm going to stop there because I forgot to brown. So I'm going to grab my brush, a little bit of the powder. And then I don't tap it because I think that takes off, you know, a little bit more, like some of the pig most of the pigmentation. So I just like shake it like this. Another person who does it or used to do it is um, Tally Joy 18. If you haven't um, watched any of her videos or seen her channel, definitely check it out. She's going to be my shout out. I know it's kind of a and like a spoiler alert, but yeah, she's gonna be my shout out this day. And if I have done her, sorry, but she's just so awesome. So, I'm grabbing some more. Oh, sorry, using my fingers. And I'm just gonna apply this to my temples and then to my jawline. So I'm just applying it under my chin, like right there on my jawline. Blending everything, and you can turn up the volume because you're probably in a quiet place or in your room lying down watching videos. Who knows where you are, but um, <laughs> yeah, just you can turn it up if it's a bit noisy in the background and you can't hear me. Sorry about that. <laughs> now I'm going to use the brush and pick up the dark brown. This one here, the darkest shade in the palette, and then I'm going to give the brush a shake. Okay, and then you just want to apply this color into like the outer, the outer bit right here. And this is just going to really darken up the look, but we don't want it to be too dark because obviously you don't, you want your eyes to match. But then you just want to remove the product. So. And then you want to kind of blend this halfway into the crease. 
and then you just grab one of your fingers and start blending this in. Like so. And once you finish blending it in, it should look the same. Kind of. I don't know. <laughs> and then you're going to take any finger, I'm just going to use my pinky, and I'm going to pick up that darkest color again. And I'm just going to blow it. And then I'll put it right on the bottom lash line and the outer corner. And I'm just pulling my eye out so it's a bit easier. But obviously if you're doing the makeup with someone, you don't want to go like this to the eye. <laughs> you just want to make them look up so it doesn't hurt as much. Well, it shouldn't hurt because you should be using a brush, not your finger. And this one's a bit more blended out, so I'm going to apply some a bit, a bit more to my other eye. Okay, and then you want to apply the lighter shade, which is this one. You want to put this on the um, center of your lids to brighten up the look. On your brow bone. And then you want to clear it up. You also want to apply this to your what am I? So I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. Bye. And trust me, it's okay. Powder does not hurt your eyes. Just be careful, especially if you're using your finger and not a white eyeliner. Use a white eyeliner if you don't. If you have one with you. But this is just going to brighten up the eye because, you know, of our dark colors. <laughs> and now... I'm going to grab the darker shade again, my brush, give it a bit of a shake, and I'm just going to fill in my brows a bit. So right at the front, sorry, I'm looking at my mirror. So right at the front and at the tail. And then I'm going to take that um, groomer. Sorry, I just put my arm on this. Um, yeah, I'm going to take that groomer and groom my brows to, you know, kind of like blend it out because you don't want them to look harsh well, I don't want to because, I mean, I'm a tick <laughs> so then I always do that okay, then I want to take a little bit of powder shake it off and I'm going to apply this to the top of my forehead. Because I forgot to do that before. So, I'm going to put this to the top of my forehead and this will look like I've been in the sun. It's been raining and New Zealand sun is a good thing to do. And then I'm also going to take that, a little bit of that powder. Blend it in my fingers. And I'm going to... Lightly dab this on the sides of my nose. You know, my nose is not like fat or anything, but it's not the skinniest nose, I guess. Um, but yeah. I recommend cleaning your fingers before doing this, but I'm just wiping it. Um, okay, then you wanna. Okay, you want to blend it out, and I look a lot paler on camera, but I'm quite dark right now. Um, but, yeah. This is the finished, the finished look. I'm not going to use the eyeliner anymore. But just apply mascara to your eyes, and then this look is all done. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!